that oh. you got? No, it was that wasn't in the book. Uh-uh. Huh? No, it's different levels that you're. It's almost like being married to God can be not married to God, but close to God. And then it has all the different steps that your soul goes through when it's purged like that. And uh, it, it's beautiful. It's, it's written beautifully. Um, yeah. It's, it's exquisite. Well, how writing, the divine actually. life. Yeah. yeah. Well, this is a perfect day because it's hard to describe divine life and the interior that you transform with grace and love. So yeah. the secret wisdom is the kingdom of God in the center of the soul. And that yes. was uh, the intellect is too hard. The soul becomes part of the whole. But they mean W-H-O-L-E or the whole of the soul and the quintessence, essence, sealed to the image. So that's very interesting that you didn't read any of that. Uh, that but it was the conduction and the mysteries of that mysticism of that love. You felt it, right? That that oh, mystic. Oh yes. Yeah, never felt well, such love before in my life. Yeah. And, well, and in this, I was also like, I was jeweled. Go ahead. There were all these jewels around me too. It, yeah, it, 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 it virtues. Yeah, it's the, the virtues. virtues with the different crystals and different colors, because yeah. you're seeing, you're visually seeing these things then. This is sight, yes. insight. It's what we call yeah. it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you, you felt the, you felt the quintessence of the essence of the. Uh, wow, that's amazing. That's a long way to come. And see, this is uh, one thing that Nathan was talking about because he has a lot of yellow in his when people see his aura, you know. And uh, do you favor a color? Right now, well, I had you... my aura picture taken once, and the girl couldn't believe it because I had so much indigo blue. Indigo blue, that's what I was picking yeah. up. So that's yeah. good. That's that's above even the heart. And, uh, you know, folks, we do the ascension is the uh, chakra, seven red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, violet. But then you look at those colors and what you're projecting as the inventor of your own soul. But we know that God, uh, the, that which has always been, is really the originator because we know we come here, but we can see the trees and the water and the fish and the the things, the the other humans, but we know, wow, we have this feeling of an other than. So the inner divine is your inner purpose, your inner initiate, and how you go in with your meditation and that Mm -hmm. feeling of allowing to receive. So you've been really good about allowing, like you said, you're meditating on the beach, you're allowing your your inner self, your inner voice, but then the outer voice becomes that outside of us, like Donna's insight or her experience or her, uh, what do they call that? Your, uh, uh, you had a epiphany. A, 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 you know a who real writes a beautiful, uh, yeah, exactly. But, but I, I'd never had an experience like that in my entire life. It was the most Well, you need to write that thing. up. Write it up so other huh? people can enjoy it. Write it okay, up I like a little. That. I can do that. Yeah. yeah. Um, you know who's a nice writer that I, I got some books recently? Uh, Jean Guyon. She, uh, one book is called Experiencing the Depths of Jesus Christ. Um, and she has several, several books. And if you ever get a chance uh, to read any of her books, she's, she's excellent. And she shows you a way to commune with God. And you really commune with God in the silence. Yeah. It's it's the silence that you commune with him, and it's just beautiful. But these books are uh, pretty good. I should send them to you. Yeah. <laughs> Why did Jesus die? Experiencing the depths of Jesus Christ. Now, that is in the Christian bookstore, but it's also used books. Uh, but who did you say wrote that? Let's see. Um, Jean, Let's J-E-A-N-N-E, Jean Guyon, G-U-Y-O-N. Okay, it says, uh, all right, well, apparently it's, it says Library of Spiritual Classics, Volume 2, Experiencing the Depths of Jesus Christ, 3rd Edition, and by Jean Edwards, by Jean Guyon, G-U-Y-O-N. Well, that's good. Uh, it says, uh, this little book conceived great simplicity. It was not written to be published. I wrote it for a few individuals who desire to love God with all their hearts. Because of the profit they received from reading the manuscript, many asked to obtain 
personal copy. So, see, you should write yours up because that was an so. epiphany. Yeah. It was a, it was a, something yeah. that everybody will probably go through, but you went through it, and there's a, it helps sometimes to people to read other purples. Like this lady that you read says she didn't even mean that to be a, a book to be put published you know she just wrote it for a few few people that wanted to feel god in their hearts so it's hard uh, to know how to write i mean to write and how do you publish it and all is there a an app that you can use to do it or uh uh-huh yeah you go uh yeah you can download i use lulu and kindle but uh it used to be create space but all of us pretty much because we're not famous and we're not waiting on independent publishers i have an imprint because my mother was a pub, we were, we published, and my I grew up in publishing, but books oh. and writers. But uh, yeah, I just use Lulu. L U L U is the easiest, and they send me a check every month. Now a lot of people, there's all kind of different companies out there, including Amazon. And Amazon used to have you go to Create Space, but now you just go to Kindle. <laughs> but if I was you, I'd, I'd, to be fair, I would go on and just list uh, self-publish a book, but don't fall for those vanity they're going to try to show you how to do it right you just start writing in a word microsoft word i use microsoft but there's all kind of self-publishing houses but uh create your own uh is the best way because otherwise because it takes a lot of time to edit and publish yeah but self-publishing just look that up but lulu online self-publishing e-company is who i use now, there's also Amazon Kindle Direct. Now, uh-huh. a lot of people go in, but they say they don't get paid on Kindle Direct. So that's up to you. But I know Lulu does send me a check, but most of the people haven't had good luck with Kindle oh. uh, getting their, their checks, including me. So uh, we don't know what's been happening to all the manuscripts, but, you know, Amazon is Amazon, and they got all of us pretty much started in ebooks, but. I went with Lulu, and they're really good about paying me oh, that's you know, for good. my little books. But yeah. like I said, you, you can sign into Amazon. I use Amazon, too. Now, my company is TJ Mars Agency, and then I help people in my company called American Communications Online because so many people don't want to be bothered. Uh, but I haven't done anybody's. I've got several people that know me that up for years publisher and they'll call me for help you know for yeah. uh, their books but it's a long process but not if you just want to get something going yeah you know what i'm saying just go ahead and get yeah. started and look up kindle and okay. look up and look Lulu, up Lulu. Right? yeah and there's others other people may tell you about but i'm just telling you those because i already write books and i use those you know, yeah. if people oh, need help. You. But I've, yeah, I've got friends that, you know, help edit and all that too, but we use Grammarly on ours. Uh, yeah, that makes sense. Do you use it? We use the I, free well, version. I'm, I'm familiar with it. Yeah, the free version. That's when I'm writing emails or whatever. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. So uh, those are the two. Now, there's another company that one of my editors uses, uh, should you self publish, but I can't think. Yeah, it says Lulu or Smashwords, yeah, and then reads the Smashwords. Uh, let's see, what's another one? Of course, the Vanities are Outskirts, Ex, Ex Libris, Kobo, self-publishing authors, uh, authors house. The you know, get in touch with me. Lightning Sources, who I started with in iUniverse and Ingram. Then there's Balker. Balker are our Balkers where you used to get your numbers from. But uh, I would I would just go with you know it's doing it yourself the cheapest way possibly, which means just take your Microsoft Word uh, and then it'll give you a we use Trade Publishing six by nine is the Trade Publisher size uh-huh. meaning your size and then you have to pick your you do your own cover, but we have okay. uh, people that do design your cover a lot of people will buy the cover. And uh, especially in romance, and then maybe get around to reading a book. But you'll be doing a self-help and sort of a spiritual book, you know. But, yeah, that's a good thing that we can share with people. 
is the yeah. fact that uh, they can write their own books. Oh, my gosh, I went over. I didn't even know. Oh. Gosh, I lost track of time. Well, I <laughs> uh, had a little technical difficulty in the beginning, but, folks, uh, we're going to start talking more about our spiritual quest and our inner voice and our meditation. And I say that prayer is for sending. You send out your thoughts and desires to God, Father, Holy Spirit, Jesus, if you will, whoever, Yadavadhe, if you're Kabbalist and uh, mystic. And uh, meditation, inner voice, inner sanctum, your inner meditation. We were teaching that in integrative medicine and with your arts and your artisans, your drawings and you know, be writing and doing your art or music and all of that and come back and share it with us what you're doing. Well, Donna, thanks for being part of our show today. It's, uh, I didn't plan on anything and nobody knew I was going to do one except I told them in Facebook from here and there I was going to return today. So, uh, And we'll do some more readings, folks. Uh, I believe I'm going to do Thursday 2 to 4 my time uh, or 4 to 6 maybe. I may have told – I know I messed up uh, – uh, Suzanne Wyman Flynn in California but because uh, I gave her the wrong time but uh, check back with me or Suzanne Wyman Flynn on Facebook about when we're doing readings and hopefully back Thursday maybe 4 to 6 so uh, hopefully that's a good time for everybody well Donna thanks get working on that book now okay thank you and, Teresa I will thank you I'm Linda. looking forward to reading it all right okay I like that. all right and thanks. look look at my books too uh it's I under Ter- Teresa J. Morris or T.J. Morris Publishing. It used to be, but now they've got me under T.J. Thurman Morris or Teresa J. Morris on Lulu. And y'all look up my YouTubes, and please, and follow me. They're free. Okay. It's YouTube.com, and I've got Teresa J. Morris, Psychic Channel Network, uh, of course, American Communications Online, T.J. Morris Agency, and all kind of YouTubes, and hundreds and hundreds of them. But some of them are teaching in the uh, last couple of months. So oh, join wonderful. me and yeah, come back on Sundays and Thursdays and Sundays to start. Okay. Okay, I make right, Thursday them... to get a little reading, Teresa. If that's all right. Okay, I'll get my cards out for Thursdays. All right, bye. love and light. Thank you. Great. Light. Thank bye. you. Okay. Bye bye. All right, folks. Uh, We're going to get out of here, ran a little over, but uh, look forward to seeing you Thursday.